In the latest VTube Studio update, they've added a new feature that lets you become bald without needing to buy a toggle from your model rigger. Here is a really quick tutorial on how to do that, as well as adding it as a hotkey so you can be bald on command. We are going to go to the avatar settings of our model, and then we are going to go to customize model. This menu is going to pop up, and we are going to hit customize multiply screen color for our meshes. Now that we are in this menu, everything you hover over is going to turn red. Anything that turns red is something that you can edit the color of, as well as the transparency. For this, we're going to make my horns transparent just for keeping this easy. So I'm going to hit this tip of my horn right here and we see it pops up on this menu right here we're going to hit the slider to make it transparent all we're going to do is take this a slider and slide it all the way to the left and now it's transparent then we come to this one click on that turn the slider on and then you can do paste last multiply color just to make this a little bit faster do that and boom another chunk is gone hit this this bottom one we're going to do left horn three paste and done i'm now missing one of my horns it's all transparent so once you've gotten everything you want to be transparent gone let's add this as a hotkey so you don't have to keep doing this every time you want to be bald we're gonna click ok to get out of this menu and we're going to go to like this little film icon this is your hotkey settings we're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom and hit this plus sign right here and this will let us make a new hotkey i'm going to call this no horns we're going to click hotkey action right here and we are going to type in art mesh color preset like that record settings right here and that is going to record all of the changes we have currently made to add it as a hotkey all we have to do is hit record and push whatever button you want to push then once that's recorded all you have to do is hit that button and it should turn it on and off and that is all you need to do to make yourself bald or make any other part of your model transparent at will. You can tell that when I turn this toggle on and off, you can kind of see the green screen show up. That's because I'm too lazy to figure out how, how the spout capture works. If you use spout capture, that probably doesn't show up. But I'm not sure. If you like this tutorial, I really appreciate it if you give a thumbs up, if you comment, all that good stuff. I'm having my 2D debut on July 12th on my Twitch. If you want to check it out, I would greatly appreciate that. We're super close to 1K on Twitch, so I would love it if you gave it a follow. The link will be in my bio. Thank you guys for watching.